It is time now for our chart of the day. And today we're talking about global debt. Higher interest rates are adding to borrowing costs for countries around the world. And that has dramatically elevated the risks of default, prompting the International Monetary Fund to step in as the lender of last resort. The Financial Times reports lending at the agency has now reached an all-time high. That came at the end of August with $140 billion dispersed across more than 40 separate programs. That number has already exceeded the amount of credit outstanding at the end of 2020 and 2021. At least five countries have already been pushed into default. And with more expected to follow, there's concern the agency is reaching the limits of its lending capacity. The IMF's total commitments, which include loans that have not been dispersed, now stand at nearly $270 billion. Inez, and we're talking about obviously a higher rate environment globally, but of course a lot of this conversation goes back to what we've been talking about all throughout the last few weeks. It is a stronger dollar also adding to that debt load. That's right. It all circles back to the U.S. dollar and the strength of the U.S. dollar vis-a-vis -vis the other currencies in the world and how foreign currencies have been sliding. And these companies abroad, or these uh, countries uh, abroad are uh, they have uh, their dollar debt in dollar. dollar. Debt. Exactly. And so that is more expensive for them. So, again, the uh, impact that a strong U.S. dollar is having abroad. Yeah, I mean, something the reason why we keep bringing it up every day, right?